Hello and welcome to the video. This is going to be another really quick tutorial video. Now I've recently been using in my thumbnails little boxes around the th thumbnail title and I thought some people might want to know how to do that. So we're going through that in this video. Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is drop a couple of photos into the timeline. Next, I'm going to scale up the photo so that it fits correctly. Then I'm going to just pop on a basic title Get rid of that at the end. From there, I'm just going to write the title, then choose the font, change the size, change the color, all that kind of thing. Actually, just another quick tip as well for what I've like been doing recently in my videos. Um, copy the photo, drag it beneath the first one, then go to the title, choose the inspector, change to stencil alpha, then search on the negative effect, drop that onto the top, and then you've got a negative effect thumbnail. Alt and G to turn that into a compound clip, and then it gives a decent negative effect of the photo that's underneath. Okay, so next, down to the generators, search on the shape, pop that over the top, then cut that off and up to the inspector. Then we're going to change it to rectangle and we're going to untick fill. Then next you can just customize it as much as you want. So change the color of it, change the drop shadow, change the blur, change the distance, change the angle, change the width to how you like it. Then to change the size of it, You either scale it up, scale it down, or hit the transform, and then you can just drag it up, larger or smaller. Then just get it how you like it to look. So I'm gonna do it again, the same with the second one now, just scale it up, and then just change the color so that I like it. And that is it, as simple as that. So another really quick tutorial. I hope it helps you out, and uh, thank you very much for watching. I'll hopefully see you in the next one.